Oh, well that was a relatively simple introduction compared to the other games, so... Hello and welcome to Let's Play Secret Files Sam Peters, which, uh, if the name wasn't obvious enough, will be following Sam Peters instead of Nina Kalinkov. Let's just quick check our... I know the last game was really quiet, so hopefully they fixed that. Um... I don't think any of those options are really important, so, uh, well, let's dive right in and see what this is about. My name is Sam Peters. I'm comprehensively great-looking, a natural blonde, and a highly intelligent one. I'm extremely tough, an exceptional journalist, and I hate modesty. Uh, for those who don't know, Sam Peters was a minor character that was in uh, Secret Files 2, but then they couldn't make room for her in Secret Files 3, although she was an archaeologist, I thought, and not a journalist. I work for Uncharted. It's basically Playboy for scientists. Fewer naked women, fewer cars, more text. We report on excavations in, and expeditions to, the remotest corners of the world. The pay is, to be exact, pretty miserable. But you get adventure on tap, and that's the best bonus you could ask for. Although sometimes they're hairy, even for my taste. My latest trip took me to Indonesia, where local archaeologists had discovered an ancient temple complex in the jungle. Team members were disappearing one after another without trace. Turns out, it was terrorists. They kidnapped me. Then my old friend Max showed up and got me out of there. And here we are. He's off trying to get a whiff of the gang's plans. I'm supposed to inform the Indonesian authorities. Oh, and a volcano has now erupted and half of the island is in flames. I have no idea where Max is now, and I'm not going looking for him in this inferno. Anyway, it's supposed to be the man who goes through flames for the woman and not the other way around. My task is clear. I have to escape from this island and bring help from the mainland. Okay. Now let's hightail it out of here. Crap. This inflatable dinghy is missing some... Uh, inflation. Reminds me of my last relationship. <laughs> so how am I supposed to get to the mainland now? Alright, so, uh... Yes, I know how to play the game. Uh, so... I guess this is gonna take place during Secret Files 2 and, uh... If if I remember, she somehow got lost while trying to find the Indonesians, but, uh... As their latest game, well, as the last game, as of this, uh... The production of this episode in the Secret Files series, you can see it's, uh... One of their best. Their anti-aliasing still needs a little work, but, uh... The 3D character model is looking pretty good. In more ways than one. So, uh... Diary, Flight from Paradise. Oh, I'm so glad they brought this back. I was so pissed we didn't have one in Secret Files 3. It just had the one line that never changed from, like, the beginning of the game. Like, oh, we're in the reactor. We gotta shut it down. You know, oh, you know, a, a message from from, from uh, Max's old friend leads you to Pop Belly Hill. It's like, dude, that was, like, six hours ago. <laughs> but... Uh, diary, flight from paradise, off Bali, Indonesia. Captured by terrorists on this godforsaken island, I'm only free because my old friend Max showed up. I've now got to get to the mainland to find help. No easy undertaking since the inflatable dinghy on the beach has had it, and a volcanic eruption has set half of the island in a blaze. That's the game guy. Okay, so. And we still have that, so. Doesn't show any sign of stopping. I hope Max is alright. Sounds like they changed the uh, voice actress for Sam Peters, like. They have, they change all the voice actors and actresses every game, but uh, this one's sounding pretty good so far. What am I supposed to do? Blow it out? <laughs> a message in a bottle. <laughs> this beach doesn't miss a single postcard cliche. I think I'm actually going to change the uh, audio balancing here real quick. Try that. At least it's balanced some better. So I don't have to, like, crank up my system volume three times, like, uh, or by 300%, like, with Secret Files 3. That was such a 
quiet game. Little cute butterfly. I, I know how to play. Okay, we're turning that off. All right. There's a note inside the bottle. Unfortunately, I can't open the top. All right, well, all in due time. Game help has been deactivated in options menu. Oh, really? That's how we're going to play this? Fine. I considered that just a quality of life thing, but fine. Oh, we can actually leave the beach. When Max came here with this boat, it was in a considerably better state. <sighs> Damn blow-up boats. There's no air in the front chamber. What the hell is Max stashed in this box? Well, let's find out. Locked. Maybe I can get it open some other way. My goodness. Max and his weakness for fancy locking mechanisms. Interesting mechanism. I'm sure that by pushing the switch, you can get Max's box open. Uh. What's that any good for? There's a line marked on the switch. What's that? Oh, I, I see. Oh, okay. So, AXM. I'm not quite sure... what that entails, but maybe it's one, two, three? Or, you know what? We probably have to exchange these with these on the other side. I've seen this before. Uh, this is a tricky one. Nope. Nope. Okay, so we can't... So we do need an empty space, so if Let's say we just move this here. That would... Open this up. We move there. We can move you down there. And then we can move you there. Okay. Alright. Um... This will be there, back there, and we can. Nope. How? We'll just do that temporarily. Um, oops, where are you? Okay, so we have two in. Uh, now. That there. Yeah, so we want this here. Or do we? Thank you. Hmm. Let's see. There's a capital A above the recess. Obviously an M. There are two lines on this switch. Uh, it's... Nope. Nope. I feel like I'm just shuffling them around at this point. 
Um... Alright, so there's three. Hopefully we don't have to move that anymore. Uh... Out of the way. It's never that easy, is it? Oh, we got you in place. Okay, almost there. We just gotta. Switch you somehow. Okay. Oh, come on, don't do this to me. be the other no no okay. um <sighs> there's a couple of different possibilities I think but uh actually since I'm having so much trouble with this I wonder if it'd just be easier to This way. Nope. Okay, you stay there, hopefully. What I want to do is swap. Those two are full. Uh, let me just here for a second. Get you in position. Maybe we can work backwards now?
there, so you can... There. You move there. And then... Oh, one guy's gotta move. I can just keep swapping these guys through. Uh, air. Come on. If I was smart, I probably would have picked up the actual pattern that they move in by now. Why was I trying to get that there? I'm a dumbass. What's that? Okay, you can do that. So you there? Good. Okay. So that opens you up. And now. We can temporarily move you there. How, uh, it's the shortest path to get this guy there. Yeah, it looks like it's this way. Okay. We'll be through. doesn't help us for this part. Freaking A. I didn't even do what I wanted to do. Oh no, I see what I wanted to do. Down. That'd be another one. I hope all what? the trouble's been what? worth it. Boots and socks. A satellite phone would have been nice. Okay, I'm not quite sure how I did that there. A stripped down air pump. Okay, so this is just a. Uh... Okay, so we gotta figure out what goes together, I guess. 
That's obvious enough. Uh, you're gonna go there. Probably something like that. Putting all the parts together shouldn't be too much trouble for a genius such as myself. Well, this probably goes on there. I just gotta figure out where, I suppose, there. There. Oh, that was the easy thing. Now the air pump ought to work again. Fresh socks are essential equipment on a long expedition. Rubber boots may be practical, but comfy and stylish? Never. There's a note inside the- Okay, she can't open them. She used this to... Okay. Can't make her wear anything. Uh, so that's great. The boat. When Max came here with the- There's no point in filling it with air until we can, uh... Max is in trouble. I need to get to the mainland and find help. Looks close, but that's actually some hell of a distance. Swimming to the mainland is not an option. The mortal remains of a crab. Definitely passed its sell-by date as a food source. But that claw might make a useful tool. Oh, okay. Oh, probably telling me I can do something. Really? Hmm. Delicious. I must definitely invite myself to dinner again. Huh, that's weird. A bullet hole. Those bastards. Laying my hands upon it is not gonna mend that hole. A completely typical Indonesian rock. I don't like to admit it, but this rock's just too big for me. All right, well, let's leave the beach and see what else we can, uh... The volcano's out of control. Whatever it is I'm doing here, let's do it fast. All right, so what have we got? Arrangement of stones. Looks like an arrow. Best be careful. It could be a trap. Nah, not interesting in the slightest. This is an interesting top-down view. Not much going on there. I'll just take the one bone. Okay, can we use the bone? I there can't open go. the bottle with that. I'll jam the crab claw onto the end. The bone is stuck fast in the crab claw. Uh. Okay. We've made like a little crab claw shovel. Something down here. Ends for quite a ways. Burning bush. The heat's so intense, this bush has caught fire. Please don't talk to me. I don't care what your name is. You're <laughs> just a simple thorn bush, aren't you? Uh, I don't think there's really anything we care about. Why would we want the socks Can on we fire? Talk about that first. The conversation will go like this. No. <laughs> We could put the rubber boots Perhaps on Perhaps I won't roast the whole boot at once. I might get hungry later. Yeah, I don't know why we would do that. Quite beautiful. Also, rather scary. Generally, more heat is better. But in this case, I'll make an exception. Alright, so... We have something to catch fire if we need it. No man is so great that a woman will go back into hell for him. And Max isn't all that in the first place. No, on this occasion, I'm going to respect that rule. Make an exception to my own and actually do what I'm told. No man is... Okay, so she doesn't want to go back any further into the jungle. Nah, nah. I don't understand why she can't open the freaking... A uh, bottle. I, mean, I think you could have opened it with either the bone or the crab claw, but. Alright, there's nothing interesting here, it seems, so I guess we'll go back to the beach for now. 
I miss anything? I've already emptied it. Ugh, empty. I mean, I can hook it up, but the air is just gonna come out that again. Would be a job of Sisyphean magnitude, so long as we still have that hole in the side. Yeah, exactly. So. A completely typical Indonesian rock. <sighs> There's a note inside. Why can't you just bash the bottle against the crate? That would open it up pretty fast, but... Okay, so she doesn't want the rocks. She doesn't want to go deeper into the jungle, which... Is that even a proper... No, it's not a proper exit, so... Okay. I could bury him if I had a shovel. Well, you have your little crab claw on a stick, but no, she doesn't want to do that. I suppose maybe the puzzle is you use the heat to melt the hole? Can we talk? Yeah, she doesn't want to do that. Perhaps I won't. I want to do that. Nothing. Bonus. She doesn't need. Okay, she's not even really an object we can interact with, really. Uh, I don't think I've missed anything that she'd be willing to pick up. Willing to pick up being the keyword here. So either I haven't looked at something right or is something. That but to no avail. Yeah. So let she'll use the side. Let's clean away this grease and sand. Oh, okay, now what? I've already cleaned it, and I don't think the socks are air- Boot. Kicking only works- Okay, so now that it's clean, maybe I didn't realize we had to clean it, but- Now maybe will you burn the boot down? Perhaps I won't roast the- Can we talk- Oh, well, we made a little bit of progress, so. I could bury him. Nah. Alright, so can we do anything else to the hole? Will she use the pump now? That would be a No. I've already... Kicking only works with cars. And men. Uh, ba -ba. Okay, so she doesn't want to use the boots on the hole, can you? Then, no, okay. I really hate to brute force it like this, but it's not really leaving me any option. Fortunately, there's not a lot of items. I hope this isn't indicative of the puzzles we're gonna see later. Because I thought Secret Files 3 had a really good, like those were good puzzles that like, you know, they made sense. You know, sometimes you had to think about them a little, but you could, um, you could work it out. But so far in this game, like, I don't even know. Like, I thought I still had to switch some things, so I don't even know. 
What am I missing? I can't. Quite beautiful. Gener the heat's so intense. Please don't. You're just a simple thorn, but. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything we can interact. None of our items can interact with each other. Not seeing anything down here. She refuses to interact with the stones or the skeleton. Doesn't show any sign. What am I? When Max came here. When Max. Damn. I've cleaned and dried the area around the bullet hole. Abracadabra, hocus pocus. <laughs> what a surprise. I can't fix it with my bare hands. What am I supposed to fix it with, lady? You won't let me. I've already emptied it. Ugh, empty. Won't bat. Oh, really? You'll bash on that, but not this. The bottle's broken into shards of glass. Shards are lucky. I can't translate this. It's either Indonesian or Malaysian. Alright, well now... Now we should be able to melt the glass fragments. Maybe that's what she's uh, going for here. Too big for me anyway. I'll cut a piece oh. of rubber out. I'll jam the piece of rubber between the claws. There we go. I think we're finally getting off this island. Like roasting marshmallows. You have to know when enough's enough. Melted enough? Alright, I think we're finally off this island. We have a top. Down the hole real quick. Perfect. Now let's pump this up and get out of here. Let's get this dinghy back on the high seas. I see no reason to highly see where the I'd say stick around so now I can get out of here at last. I haven't phoned in for days. My editor will be going loopy. Uh weren't you gonna to go to the mainland to get help? Home at last. First, I'm gonna treat myself to a drink. And then I will listen to the 25 messages my charming editor has left for me. <laughs> he sounds a bit miffed because I've only just got back from Indonesia. <sighs> my excuses had better wait. He's already got a new job lined up for me. Oh, it's an important one by the sounds of it. Could be big for the magazine. I'd better not waste any time. Sure, a girl like me can find a new job really fast, but it still sounds like hassle I don't need. I'd best take the next flight to Berlin. I need to meet up with a Professor Hartman. He heads up a research group at Humboldt University, and our magazine is one of the sponsors of his Africa expedition. It seems that our professor is hot on the trail of some scientific sensation out there. <laughs> How often have I heard that shit? The sensation is usually some frothy bullshit that we can't even use to fill the summer news gap. Huh, okay, so... Ersten... Spetso? Quite sure what that means. 5th of May 2008, expedition in... Vicante. That may be a country or city in Africa. Start at Grossus Evinspiel. A big... something play? Big game, maybe? Big prize? Anyway, I'm clinging on to this job, which means I'm headed out to Africa with the professor at the next opportunity. I don't know exactly where we're going, so anything could be in store. <laughs> and that is exactly what I love about this damn job. The 
Biological Institute. This is where I'm supposed to meet Professor Hartman. The gate's locked. Yes, can I help you? Hello, my name is Peters. I've got an appointment with Professor Hartman. I'm sorry, but he's no longer in the building. What? But he wanted to meet me here this evening. According to our database, the Professor is away on an expedition. He's already set off? But I was supposed to be going with him. Yes, well, not every department of this facility is as efficiently organized as the security department is. Shit. My boss is gonna go bananas when he finds out I've missed this shot. What am I supposed to do now? Can you hear me? Yes. Uh, okay, do you know... Does Professor, Professor Hartman have a cell number by any chance? Eh, doesn't look like it. We only have his office number here. Do you know where the professor was headed? No, but you could ask his secretary. Great. Where is she? Uh, Frau Muller has already left for the weekend. She'll be back Monday morning. Have you got her home number? We do. But I couldn't possibly give out private staff details to members of the public. Be patient. And come back Monday. Patience is definitely not an option. No professor, no story. I need to find him as fast as I can. If I only knew where he was headed. Do you know exactly when the professor jilted me? Just a second. <laughs> it looks like it was this morning. And he's gonna say no to this course. Now I'm really in a jam. Could you perhaps pop along to Professor Hartman's office and see if he's left a note for me? If he had left you a note, then it would be here at reception, I'm sure. Could you perhaps imagine letting me into his office for just a mo? If you'd like to know precisely, no, not in my wildest dreams. But I wish you a refreshing, stress-free weekend. Same to you. With bells on. Looks like I'm gonna have to help myself. No gate stopped me before. I need to get into the professor's office to find out where he's gone. If I mess up this assignment, then that's my job out the window. Alright, so I think that sets up our uh, next expedition pretty well. And I think this is a good stopping point. So, with that, thank you all for watching and stay tuned for next time. See you then.